Let me show you something very, very interesting. It's the blend tool in Adobe Illustrator. So for example, you design a logo. It's pretty boring. It's just a circle, right? Of course, you can make it like wider, okay? Uh, but that doesn't mean anything, okay? So you just make it wider, maybe make it, uh, I don't know, maybe specific color. So for example, I got this uh, like bluish color and make it blue. Yeah, pretty good. But it doesn't mean anything. So what I'm gonna do is to duplicate this shape. So click here, I can click this and duplicate and move it to a specific place. So here comes the interesting part. I can move this to a a place maybe here, okay, and then I'm going to move it to like different places. So one place here, one place here. Okay? And then what I'm gonna do is to change the shape just a slightly. So for example, I want to change this, maybe something like this, okay? Or maybe something like this. It doesn't really matter. I can even rotate it if I want, okay? And then I'm going to change this color. So click here, uh, maybe change that to maybe yellowish color, orange, okay? And then I'm going to blend these two shapes together. So select this two and click this repeat and click this blend. So wait for the magic happens. Whoa, that's uh, that's magic, right? So what's, what's that? It's a it's a kind of a repeat. So why is got they like even a gradient change? That's because you need to change the property here. So you click this property. As you can see, we got this like sixty steps of blend. We can step, we can smooth, we can have a distance. It doesn't really matter. Let me just use the steps, and then I can change the steps. Okay, I can increase, but it doesn't really change that much. Okay, I don't know why the camera is gone. Okay, the camera is back. Sorry about that. So I can decrease this to a certain number. So you guys can see, wow, this is just a you know, few steps and gradually change the shape as well as the color. Okay, and I can just do increase so you guys can see. Yeah, gradually change, change, and it's become gradient. Of course, you can do something like this. Doesn't really matter. Okay, let me just. Uh, Make it something like this, and then since the whole part is a um, gradual repeat change, and it's a blend from a specific shape to another shape, I can change the, I can change the starting point as well as the end point. Okay, so click, so it's, we can bounce. Okay, and I can like rotate this. It's amazing. So we can get the, some design like this, and um, yeah, and then maybe change it a little bit, and then uh, maybe put it here, and then add some text, okay? Just uh, play around with this, it's amazing. 